gas burners. One of the best way to cook your food when you're hiking or camping. And today I have two different types of gas burners. And I'm moving from one to another and I will explain you why. Hello and welcome to the Stranger channel. And today, how I already said, I have two different type of gas burners. And I'm gonna start from the first one. And I have this one for about five years. I've been using this gas burner for about five years. But, but, I'm moving to another one and I will explain you why. This gas burner is perfect. I had no issues. Yeah, always works fine. I cook my food so many times and this gas burner never let me down. I will show you my setup, my kind of cooking setup. What I have here, I have a large gas cylinder. Yeah, I'm always using large gas cylinders because it's kind of for the peace of mind. Yeah, I like them. Some people are using the small ones, but I'm always using large ones. And look, this gas burner, boom, ready, ready. Now you can actually cook your food. Also, as example, I will show you my cooking set. Yeah, so I have my pot and I have my pan. So, what is wrong with this gas burner and why I'm changing? Couple of reasons. One of them is high. And of course you can say that, you know what? Just use a small gas cylinders. But, I don't want it. I want to use the large one. And now, I will show you how it works for me. So I have my gas cylinder, I have my gas burner, and I have my cooking pot, yeah? But most of the time you somewhere outside in an outdoor environment, and uh, most of the time it's windy. Yeah, so what do you need? You need a wind protection. And this is my wind cover. How you can see yeah my setup it's much higher than the gas burner so basically this windshield doesn't work for me because of the high so that is the main reason why I'm changing this gas burner and the second thing is because of this gas burner for me it's not wide enough so when I'm putting my cooking pot I would like that it would be a bit more wider or if I'm using my pan it's exactly the same thing how you can see it's wide enough but I would like to be more wider, to be more stable. And now I will show you what I have here. This is not sponsored video. I pay my own money for all this stuff. This is my new gas burner. And I'm not really talking about the brands because I think all of them, they've been made in the same factory and it comes out from the factory by the different brand. Because this one, I believe it's a uh, Van Gogh. Yes, it's a Van Gogh. And this one is Lixada, I guess. But how I said, I don't really care about them, about the brand. So what I have here, this is a different type of gas burner. And it's probably already very obvious why. So first thing, 
is how wide it is. If you will compare this gas burner and this one, the difference is big. Another thing, yeah, how you can see, this one goes on the ground and then you can attach any size of the gas cylinder any size there is no difference it's large or it's small because it doesn't affect the height of your gas burner how you can see I can cook on the ground and also I can use my windshield I can properly use my windshield Ta -da! so that's the main reason why I'm changing and if I want to use a cooking pot it's same thing and it's more stable because of how wide is the platform the top of the gas burner so I'm not saying that this one is bad it's absolutely fine if you prefer smaller size it's not that much smaller you can compare by the by the by the box yeah so this is the small one and this is the bigger one there is not much of difference so it's not gonna take that much space in your backpack but you gonna be able to properly put on the ground yeah and protect from the wind and you don't have to worry that it will fall off yeah, actually so many times it's happened to me with this one yeah, when I was cooking and uh, the ground it wasn't that uh, flat it wasn't really on the level that's maybe my fault as well but how you can see it can just slide off so I would probably recommend to get this one because of the height also I never tried because this gas burner is new for me but I heard that at the end of the gas in your in your gas uh, cartridge in your gas cartridge you can just turn upside down and you can actually use the last gas in your gas cartridge so I know I will try and I will let you know also this one has a like a fire starter but I don't think so that it will last too long because how we all know it has same mechanism as a lighter and most of the time they not last too long but I don't really care about about this kind of thing so to start yeah how we can see there is a special uh, gas release I would call it I know switch and you can just open the gas boom it's ready it is ready it's working and you can put your pan or your cooking pot on it and then when you finish you just turn the gas off and it's done I would like to hear your opinion which one you using and which one you think is better for you is a smaller one because of the size or you actually using this one because for one or another reason is better for you so this was the short video about the gas burners 
Thank you for watching. And as always, I will see you in my next video. You all take care.